Well, this is Susan with the Blue Bottle Bunny Farm channel, and today I have an unexpected bug out bag tip. You know, if you smoke or you vape and had to stop suddenly, it often makes you really cranky. And in an SHTF situation, you want to have as calm a head as possible, and you don't want to be jonesing for nicotine. So we keep nicotine patches in our bug out bags. Um, it just helps us because we have that security of knowing it, that, you know, if the battery goes dead and we're unable to charge it, you know, we do have a, a solar charger, you know, that can charge up our, our batteries, but, uh, you know, it may be being used for more important life-saving things or, you know, we may run out of juice eventually and need to just be able to wean ourselves off nicotine. So I have um, nicotine patches in both of our bug out bags. So I just thought that was an interesting tip that not a lot of people, I've never heard anybody else mention it. So I thought I'll be the first one to say that, yes, this is in my bug out bag. You know, I want to have as calm a head as possible. When I quit smoking cold turkey, I was grouchy. Oh, and Randy was grouchy too. We just, we had some fusses just out of just purely wanting something that our bodies couldn't have right then. And so you're gonna be uncomfortable anyway. Bugging out is not gonna be a comfortable situation. So you wanna make yourself as comfortable as possible. You may be in a situation where if you're a smoker, it would be dangerous for you to smoke. Maybe someone's pursuing you or looking for you and you don't want to give yourself away with the smell. There's all sorts of reasons why you would not want to smoke or vape in a SHTF situation, but you don't want to be distracted by that nagging feeling of, of needing something or wanting something that you just can't have. When you get like that, it makes you really, really grouchy and you're want to, gonna to want to have as clear a head as possible. So that's why I put nicotine patches in both of our bug out bags. Um, if, you know, you can cut them in half or quarters. That They don't recommend that you do that, but I buy the highest strength possible and I cut mine in halves or quarters or whatever so that you can ration these out if you have to suddenly stop smoking or vaping. You know, so there's my tip of the day. I hope you found it useful, and if you did, please give me a like and subscribe to our channel. So, thanks for listening to me. I'm out.